Hello and welcome to Puzzle Master. This is the Puzzle Guy and in this video I will show you how to solve Jigsaw Puzzle 29. This puzzle was designed by Yu Asaka and it was awarded with the Jury Honorable Mention at IPP38 in San Diego in 2018. This puzzle has 29 parts, uh, all of them are made of acrylic and the difficulty level of this puzzle is 10 out of 10 and the object is to put all these parts into a tray provided. But there are two twists. First of all, this puzzle has five corner pieces. As you can see, there are four inner corners and there is a fifth corner piece in the middle. So you have to put somehow all these five corner pieces into a tray. And second is uh, that this tray is only 20, uh, uh, 25 pieces, so it's five by five. But we have 29 uh, pieces, so it's pretty difficult to fit them into a smaller tray. But there is a trick how to do it, uh, there are actually a few tricks, and I will show them to you a little bit later. If you like Jigsaw Puzzle 29 and you want to buy it, go to puzzlemaster.ca. And now I will show you how to solve this puzzle. The solution of this puzzle is so difficult that it may take me 10 to 15 minutes to assemble it, even though I know how to solve this puzzle. And it is really difficult to explain you which part to use, since all the parts, a lot of parts are very similar. So I organized all these parts in such a way that it will take me a minimum amount of time to assemble it and you can see the result and it will help you to solve your puzzle. So first what you have to do is to make these two lines, it's going to be pretty easy to find all these pieces. And next uh, is uh, like the major step that you have to do is to stop thinking uh, as when you try to solve a traditional jigsaw puzzle. So what I'm uh, talking about is this, you have to take this piece, it's not a corner piece, it's not a side piece, this piece is supposed to be somewhere in the middle in a traditional uh, jigsaw puzzle. But here this piece goes right to this side. So you can see, next piece goes close to it and as you can see again this odd piece that's not supposed to be in here and three odd pieces and two regular pieces are creating this side. So the side on the, the line on this side will be almost the same. So we have to put one part like this and goes just a regular part, then goes this odd part. And here goes a regular part that's supposed to go with this side uh, to the right, but it goes with this side to the middle of the, part, the puzzle. Next, uh, the fifth corner piece, and it is really tricky, usually it goes somewhere in a corner, but here corner piece goes right in the middle of the puzzle. And one more piece that has a straight line, it goes again in the middle of the puzzle. That's what makes this puzzle very tricky to solve. So next, you have to put this part, and when you fill all these side lines, it's going to be pretty easy to find which part uh, to put in the middle. And here is the tricky part as well. When you have three parts, you can see that two of them have a straight line and one of them is like a regular jigsaw part. And you don't have any straight lines in here, so it seems like impossible to put this part uh, in the puzzle. But it is possible when you put this part you will see that two straight lines were created and now it is pretty easy to fill the, all the gaps and the puzzle is solved. As you can see, solution is very complicated, it is very difficult to find this solution and it, it may take you quite some time to find solution by yourself. But this puzzle is very good, very interesting and if you like uh, to try some other great puzzles created by Yu Asaka, and I highly recommend you to try them, go to puzzlemaster.ca. See you next time!